What's happening, everybody? It's your boy Ricky Sykes, Pretty Ricky, Ricky Bobby, and we are currently in the Clarence Brown Theater, getting ready for our production of Raising in the Sun, and we are right in front of the stage right now. There's the set, the um, the props, the furniture, all that stuff is covered, so it doesn't mess up like in between shows. But I will walk on stage and just show y'all like what I get to handle. Like I play one of the moving men. It's not, a, it's not a big role, but hey, I got excited because hey, I'm in A Resin in the Sun. I'm, in, I'm on the Clarence Brown stage. So I got super excited. Like here's the program for A Resin in the Sun by Lorraine Hansberry, African-American cast. It was pretty, pretty awesome that I got picked for this show. And if you want to come see it, you have until March 10th to come see it. So I say, get whoops. <laughs> whoops. I say, get your tickets today. You want to come see it? You got to come see it. You better come see it ASAP. Get your tickets today for it. Also, it sells out. And I got extra excited because since this is my first time being in a program, my picture and my bio gets to be in it also. So you got my picture, my headshot. Hold up. Still blurry. And my bio and my character. And I'm with the I'm with a pretty, I'm pre a pretty great group of actors. Like, who we got? We got Khalil. He plays one. Th he plays Travis. He we got two. We got two kids playing Travis. And one of them's Khalil. We got Kristen Adair who's playing Ruth. We got Sydney who's playing Bobo. And Brian, he's my partner. We also he's also a moving man. Neil Friedman, Mr. Linder, Neil Friedman, Neil actually taught me in acting 221. I think that's what it was, 221. He was my teacher. And he taught me he taught me a good deal. Who else we got? We got James, James Jocelyn. I'm gonna skip this next one because I want y'all to be prepared for her. We got Margaret Odette playing Benita. Also James is playing Walter Lee. We got Richard playing Asagai. You've seen me, I'm playing one of the moving men. We got Tramel Tillman, who's playing George Murchison. And here's Tyson Wood, he's playing the other, he's the other guy that's playing Travis. And it's directed by Woody King Jr. He's known for founding the New Federal Theater in New York. And it was a privilege to work under him. And it's also a privilege to work under this actress who's known for a lot of things, Miss Lynette McKee. Hold up, it's kind of blurry. Yes, Lynette McKee. You may know her from Sparkle. She was on, you can see right here, she was on Which Way Is Up, Bruce's Millions, The Cotton Club, Gardens of Stone. Who we got? Lift, Cuba, Men of Honor, Around Midnight. She was in a lot of stuff. Jungle Fever, Malcolm X, He Got Game, She Hate Me. Look at all this stuff. A day in black and white. Honey, ATL. Fast food, fast women, honey too. Look at all this stuff. She was in a lot of st she was in a lot of stuff, and it was kind of amazing that I got to work under her and under Woody King, and also with a lot of other actors and actresses. And, and like I said, I was gonna make this thing short. I just wanted to give y'all like an, a Raising in the Sun update, and plus what I'm doing with um what I'm doing with Fat Boys. Like, I still got Fat Boys that I'm doing, working on right now. Like, right after the play is over, I will be finishing Fat Boys. I got two peeps on stage right now. He, uh, he's sweeping right now. There's Mr. Stefan. So I'm just pretty, I'm pretty excited about what I get to do as far as working with these actors on this show, under this director. Like, it's a big, it's a big thing for me. The fact that it's a small role, I don't care. It's still a big thing for me. I'm glad. I need the light. Your station? Oh. 
that was Mr. Robert Steffen. He's the he's the soundboard operator. And Mr. Caleb Cook, you can't really see him, but he's sweeping the stage right now. He's one of the crew. He's like one of the behind the scenes moving men. But I'm one of the feature moving men. And right now, I'm getting ready for the music already. <laughs> I'm filming a blog. You're filming a blog? Yeah. This is, this is a thing for me. I do blogs. Okay, right now, I'm finna go to the stage and show y'all what I do on stage, and that's move furniture. Ain't that right, Robert? Right. I move furniture. So let us get to the stage. I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna run. So, like I said, I do the last scene in the play. So I'm one of the last people to show up ever. And when I show up, my first aim is this couch right here. It's covered right now, but you'll get the idea when you come see it. Me and Breon, we take this couch, we move it off the stage. Then I come back on stage, I take this coffee table right here. I do that by myself. And after I take the coffee table, I come here for the record player. It's under here somewhere. I take the record player, and then I take it right back off stage. And Robert is feeling the music right now. He's feeling it. Doing the sound check, baby. Go ahead. Well, where'd it go? Where's the sound? Where is the sound? It's betraying me. Because there should be sound coming from here, there. Let's see. And let's go backstage. So right before I come out, I just come like right here. This is like my waiting area. Until I hear my cue, I come right on stage and do whatever. I come right on stage and I do whatever. I do what I'm supposed to do, and then after the play is over, we got curtain call, and I run out to the stage, take my bow to this many people. There's the problem. You hear that, Ricky? What happened? Now it's playing. Oh, God. I take my bow, and I come over here to the side. That's what is going on. I think that's the sound cue. Oh, the sound check. But I'm on the good and then that's me as far as my character now I want to do one last thing for y'all and show y'all my dressing room area so let us go this is the dressing room area what's up my bro like, I just, I love What? We missed it. First of all, men's dressing room. Okay, let's walk in. And as we walk in, we have a list. As you can see, I'm on this side. Everybody else, that side. And then let's continue. Like I got here early so I can do this, um, so I can do the vlog. So I just wanted to make sure I just want to let y'all know, hey, I'm doing, I'm still, I'm doing my thing as an actor. I'm doing Raising the Sun, and I'm very excited about it. I got a lot of friends coming to see me. Hey, it's a small role. I'm still doing my thing, but I still got the support of everybody, and I'm, I really appreciate it. Makes me glad I got support of my friends and my family. And I'm going to continue to pursue this dream that I have as an actor. But here is hold up, my dressing room area. Like I got my own, something I can put my valuables in, my own name tag, and then I got my own name on the mirror right here. So, Mm, I did say this was going to be short, but this is not going to be the only thing. Like I said, I don't know. That's pretty much it. Like, I didn't want to give, 
I didn't want to give like a serious update about this like a small update. This only includes a raisin in the sun. I'll do another vlog about what's going on with school and what's going on with fat boys extensively. But I'm not gonna give it I'm not gonna be able to get to fat boys until after the play is over. And the play is taking a lot of and the play is taking a lot of my schedule. Like um I'm busy. I'm super busy at nights, so I don't get much sleep anymore. So I'd be real tired. I've been getting sick, but I've been beating it. I'm still trying to be ahead of my classes. It's hard, but I'm still gonna I'm still trying to do everything. And I don't know I don't I, I, I don't know what to talk about anymore. I I, I did. I was gonna say I wanted to give y'all a little raising in the sun thing, so this is it. So I don't know, I don't know, that's just it y'all. Um follow me on tonight's opening night, seven thirty at the Clarence Brown Theater. Like, I think we have shows like is it it's either Wednesday through Sunday. Wednesday through Saturdays, seven thirty curtains, Sundays are two o'clock curtains. Clarence Brown Theater, UT's campus, come see me in action as one of the moving men, but come see Woody King's action as he directs this play. Come see Lynette McKee, James Jocelyn, Chris Nadell, Mag Maggie, Adet, Tramel, Neil, Travis, Khalil, Sydney, Breon, myself. We come see everybody. Hope I did not forget anybody. I'm trying to think of all the women. Do not, I, I don't want to forget anybody, but I think that was everybody. Do not forget, do not just come check it out. It, it is an amazing play. I'm excited. Everybody else is excited. So come be excited with us. And I will give y'all a more extensive update later. So this is your guy, Ricky Sykes. Follow me on Facebook, Ricky Antonio Sykes. Follow me on Twitter at CC Balance. Follow me on Instagram at Skeeto Tarantino. And subscribe to my YouTube channel, youtube.com slash prettyricky1999. I put all the information after the uh, video anyway, so subscribe, 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 and uh, enjoy the show whenever y'all come see it, just enjoy it because it is enjoyable, so I'll talk to you guys later, gotta go.